What's up YouTube, it's Philo here, and today is going to be my best video games of 2015 by Philo Films this year, uh, awards 2015 contest, uh, finals, and I got three best games of the year that I'm going to talk about, um, just some different games, uh, for different systems and stuff, but, you know, as a, as a hardcore gamer, I play everything, and these are the three best games by far this year. Number three is the Animal Crossing Amiibo Festival. Uh, Animal Crossing Amiibo Festival brings how awesome the Amiibos are to a whole new level. Um, it's just, it's so fun to play with the Amiibos and everything, you know, and you just like, it's like a Animal Crossing meets Mario Party type of game, which is what we always wanted in the next Animal Crossing game. And it's just, it just shows how innovative Nintendo really is um, when it comes to video games. So that's number three. If you guys haven't, if you guys have played Animal Crossing Amiibo Festival, Post in the comment section below how awesome the game was. Number two is a really hardcore game called The Order 1886. Uh, probably the most hardcore game that came out this year. Uh, let me know if you guys have played it as well. Um, I'm not going to give too much away because it's a really deep, in-depth game. Long gameplay, really well done. Great graphics. It's on the PlayStation 5. Um, but it takes place in 1886 and it's about The Order. So check out The Order 1886. Um, fantastic game on the, on the PS, on the, on the Xbox two or whatever, something like that. Um, the last game that I'm going to talk about the number one game of the year. And, and this is a sequel. I don't always do this because sometimes sequels, uh, well, sequels are always better than the original, but I want to talk about something else, but the very best game of the year by far is Tony Hawk's pro skater five. People have been waiting for this game for 25 years since, Pro Skater 4 came out in like 2001 or something like that. Um, wow. Finally, Pro Skater 5 comes out and it's everything we had hoped for. It is by far the most in-depth, well-done skateboarding game um, I've ever played. Um, it's just a great soundtrack, a lot of really great graphics. You know, finally, you know, caught up with 2015, Tony Hawk, Tony Hawk games are kind of dated, the old ones. But this one is just perfect, great graphics really precise gameplay it does exactly what you want to when you're trying to do tricks and stuff i probably put 60 or 70 hours into this game just because it's so fun i play it every day probably um it's by far by far the best game of the year and if you disagree with me then you're wrong so what were your some of your favorite games of the year i know i there are other great games that came out this year uh, that i didn't mention but uh, let me know what you guys think in the comment section below about these top three games of 2015 and what are some games that you're looking forward to in 2016. So I hope you guys had a great year. Uh, I'll be doing one more video for this year tomorrow, and, um, and then I will be back until next year. So, so there's that. So uh, I'll, I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye!